Hello loves, dark side back again with another grinding video. Yeah. So, okay guys, so I want to show you about this workaround that I've been doing the last few days. Uh, I've been helping a lot of people, helping lower levels, helping newer players, especially people that have never done the Kyle Perico heist before and they're trying to do it, but they're having some problems. You know, whether it's like uh, sneaking, sneaking past the guards or doing the, the, you know, the fingerprint thing or whatever. So, I'm just going to show you guys some other ways, too. So, if you open up your phone and go to the blue square with the circle with the person in it, you can actually go on call to heists here. I would, wouldn't recommend doing the Doomsday Heist. You're not going to make a lot of money on that, for one. And two, it's very challenging. So, if you're lower level, that's not going to be the heist you're going to want to do. You're going to either want to do the Casino Heist or the Kyle Perico. But listen, I'm telling you this right now. If you do not answer the party invite like if someone invites you to a party join it whether you have a mic or not join it because like me if i ask you to join a party and you don't join it and you're like level 20 or 30 or something like that you're not going to be in the heist you're going to get kicked out i'm going to kick you out so i wanted to show you a couple other ways if you register as a ceo or a vip there are certain missions in an invite-only lobby. I'm in an invite-only lobby right now. Certain missions that you could do solo and make some money, like Sightseer, Headhunter. Um, the one, I don't remember, it's where you have to go find a briefcase at the airport or like a different location. Hostile Takeover. That one you don't need any certain vehicles for. Some of them you need certain vehicles for, like the uh, the Phantom Wedge. You could do Plowed. Uh, the uh, Blazer Aqua you could do. Uh, what is it called? Uh, there's another one for the Blazer Aqua. You have to own certain vehicles. P uh, stockpiling. That's another one. Certain vehicles you need to do some of these VIP works and CEO works. But some of them you don't. So you could just register as a CEO and go do these in, 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 like in an invite-only lobby by yourself. So now I'm going to register as an MC president. And I'm going to go over to my clubhouse. I'm going to show you the missions that you can do in there. Now this is more for lower level players, but there's something coming up that I want I have for everybody. Okay, so if you're new to the game, this is the stuff you're gonna want to do. If you just got your clubhouse and you want to try and grind some money, yeah, they only pay like fifteen thousand, but sometimes they do make these things double money, so you can make up to like thirty to fifty, even seventy five thousand on some of the things if you have enough players to help you. So, all right, um, so I'm flying over to my motorcycle clubhouse. I actually passed it. I'm gonna go back and, and go back to it again. I just realized, I'm like, where am I flying to? But, uh, yeah. So basically, right in here, you just go into your motorcycle clubhouse and go up to, like, go into the little boardroom area. I believe they call it chapel in the real motorcycle clubs. Like, on the, on the real world, they call it chapel. And then when they all get together, it's called church. Uh, yeah, church. That's what they call it. So in here, go inside of your motorcycle clubhouse and go into your little boardroom area. And then there's going to be a wall. And you're going to see it's going to say motorcycle club contracts. And you could do those 100% solo in an invite-only lobby and still make like fifteen dollars to $30,000 like by yourself. And it won't even take you that long. Maybe like five, six minutes, something like that. If you have a flying vehicle, it's going to be even easier. Some of these are a little challenging, but they are a lot of fun though. You know what I mean? Okay, so back to this thing I was telling you guys about with this uh, on-call here. So, for example, say you went on-call and you went to the Kyle Perico heist. You did it with somebody. Now you come back out, okay? You're going to have, like, a 50-minute cooldown. You can't do it again. However, if you press the home button and go to looking for group post, you'll find that people put posts in there looking for someone to help me do Kyle, um, someone that knows how to hack. You might not know how to hack because you might be low-level, but... Someone might still accept you as long as you have, uh, you know, like join their party if you have a headset or whatever. Join their party because someone, you, people put posts in there looking to help low levels make money. I'll run Kyo for you. Um, helping low levels make money all the time. And then you don't have to wait about the cooldown. You don't have to wait for it. You can like, you don't have to worry about it, man. You could just like kind of, it's like, kind of like a workaround. You don't have to wait for the cooldown like through this way. If you go to the looking for group posts thing. Because I, I did two Kyos, like, back-to-back, -back, literally. One, I went on call to someone's, and another one, someone said, looking for someone that knows how to hack. I went in, I answered his message, I answered his uh, ad, and I said, I can help you hack, I can do it for you, I'll even show you how to do it. I did it, and then boom, and then I did it again, and I went on call to uh, Pacific Standard. Someone needed help with the Pacific Standard heist, and I did it that way, even though we kind of messed it up, it was kind of screwed up, but... 
Yeah, so it's just kind of a workaround that if you don't, don't want to wait the cool down, the 50 minute cool down, go look in those group, uh, was it looking for group posts? Because some people have, you know, listen, uh, you could be any level and I'll help you run Kayo or whatever, I'll run it for you. Or the casino heist, any level. You know, people have those in there. But you got to join the party, man. You got to join the party. You don't have to talk, but as long as you can join the party, if you've never done it, and uh, like me, all the time, I invite low levels and, and newer players all the time. All, you, all I ask you to do is just follow me. Because if, like I said, if we're doing a sneaky approach or, a, you know, like a stealthy approach, and you go in guns blazing and you screw it all up, I'm going to kick you out. Easy. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to boot you out, man. That's just the way it is. Because I don't want to, I'm trying to do it nice and quickly and easily for everybody that's with us. And so we get in and out, everybody makes money, and no messing around. But I don't need somebody going in guns blazing and blowing the whole thing. You know what I'm saying? So, but yeah, look for the group post thing. It's the looking for group post. Press the home button and go over to it. You'll find it. Also, you can come here to the S, to the LD, or to the M over here, and you can start up what they call contact missions, right? And then you'll be put in a group with, like, maybe two or three other people. All depends on how many people are there. You need at least two to start these, most of these. And then you'll, after you finish the first contact mission, you'll make anywhere between like twenty to thirty-five thousand dollars, like maybe like ten, twelve minutes worth of work. Not the best pay, but you know if you're trying to grind it out and make a little bit of money and have some fun, those are good. Especially if you get a good group with you, you know. And then after that finishes, you'll be put into a, like a, a pool with another, you know, another mission, and you'll be with the same people. And then you guys can just keep grinding those out. But here, this is the uh, the uh, Kasatka best way to make money in the game for the Kyle Perico. That's what you want to earn. That's what you want to try and uh, get your goal to be, is to get that Kasaka, man. If you don't have it already, get it. 2.2 mil, that's all you need to get you in the door. You know what I mean? And then, that's it, man. That's the best money-making way in the game right now. Like, it's the best way to make money. It really is. Like, never has it been so easy to make money in this game with the Kyle Perico guys. I mean, seriously, you can, under an hour, like, under 45 minutes, I can make, like, 1.6 to 1.8 mil by myself, in and out, undetected, and it's unbelievable. It's crazy. They, I, don't, I can't even believe they're still letting us make that much money on this heist. But anyway, uh, I don't know what I'm doing here, but, um, uh, what was I doing? I don't remember, but, um, yeah, I think I was just showing you again where you can just go, like, to the on-call thing. Just go to the, open your phone and go to the blue square, the circle with the person in it. And then you'll be able to go on call to like a heist or something like that. You want to definitely try for the Kayo or the casino heist. And like I said, if you're lower level and they invite you to the party, join it, man. Because they're going to kick you out probably because you don't know what to do. And uh, just listen to them. They'll tell you what to do, especially if it's a higher level player. And, you know, because I don't mind lower levels helping me or, you know, making them money or whatever. I don't mind them coming along. Just as long as they listen to what I tell them to do. That's the only thing. The only thing. If you don't join my party and you don't listen to what I tell you to do, then I'm going to kick you out. So, all right. But, um, yeah, so this is the Simeon here over here. You could start this, just walk into it, and boom. You're put directly into a contact mission. I'm going to back out of it, actually. Uh, but I just wanted to show you guys real quick, like, what it looks like if you've never done any of these missions. It's going to put you in a lobby with, like, two or three other people. See, there's a couple other people in here already. And you could do this. You know, this mission's a little hard, but, you know, they're, they're somewhat, you know, decent players. So they're over level 100, so I'm sure they're pretty decent. But that would be good for you if you're, like, level 20 or 30. These guys would be good to play with because they probably know what they're doing. They probably have a couple weaponized vehicles and stuff like that to make it a little easier. So, but, yeah, and then after this, you'll be kicked out and directly, not kicked out, but put into a lobby of like all the different missions you can vote to go on to next. And you'll probably be in with the same people on the next mission as well. So yeah, those are just a few ways to make some money. Like I said, don't forget the, uh, the cool down on the, uh, Kyle Perico and the casino heist. If you already did it, you're not going to be able to do it. It's going to be like a 50 minute cool down, but that looking for group post is definitely a workaround around that. I've, I ran two or three heists back to back with that yesterday and today i did the same thing just going on call and helping people do the heist you know and uh some people are even willing to pay more than 15 percent. but i'm like no i don't need the money i'm just trying to help you out and that's it man you know just do that so if you already did one and you have that um cool down timer go on call to like a, or not on call but go to the looking for group post thing and you'll find someone that's doing a heist somewhere whether it be the casino heist or the kyle perico hit them up man it can't hurt you know you want to make, try and make as much money as possible. Get that 
Just get that submarine for yourself if you don't already own it. So, all right, guys. I'm out. Peace.